get the best result if you stop annoying me. Looks like you found the computer room after all. Vector, why are you here? The GRN allowed me to use their database in one of my investigations. Looks like it might be a bigger case than I thought. <laughs> I don't have time for this. <laughs> Telling me where to go. of chaos is upset. Sonic doesn't cope with the Emerald's protection. Although he dared to say the opposite. Professor Eggman believes that he can test our patience. According to our soldiers, Eggman has attacked Sector W. Stop him and deliver the Emerald to us. We'll take care of the rest. Do not fail me, Shadow.
Rouge, are you there? Hey, Shadow. Why did you leave immediately? You could have come to my office and said hi. Didn't have enough time. Where's the objective's location? Well, you're on the right track. Is there any information on the incident that happened there? Uh-huh. I found out that the outbreak was from two Chaos Emeralds. Apparently, the stones were out of contact for way too long and started causing havoc. Shadow, are you listening to me? Yes, Rouge. Continue tracking my signal. I'm on my way. See the remains of Edmund's robots. He's been here.
suis je again. Rouge, I don't think the presence of an emerald inside this temple. Doctor has beaten us to it. What was that all about? Ugh. That reaction from the Emerald. It was something else, eh? T Tails! Come on. Wake up, buddy. This is no time to nap. 
Still putting your friends in danger. Because you can do it alone. What are you doing here? Working. This time, the doctor has bitten off more than he can chew. He's even managed to get on Ji-Yuan's bad side. So, that's what's been going on. But, Gun's bots are too rusted to tell us and Eggman apart. <laughs> even they think you are being a pest. However, the situation has changed, Sonic. The disappearance of the Chaos Emeralds has awakened something, and it longs for destruction. I can't get distracted from my mission. Not so fast! Leave Eggman to me! I still owe him a butt-kicking for what happened on the island! <laughs> Remind me, wasn't it Juan and your friend that stopped Eggman? When you could not. <laughs> That's because you knocked me off the island! Well, maybe you should stop getting in my way. The way I see it, you're the one in my way! Thanks to you, Admin is getting away! That was a warning shot! Now's your chance, Sonic! Such foolishness. <coughs> I gotta catch up. Rouge, what is the situation? Oh, looks like Eggman was expecting us. The perimeter is fortified with robots everywhere, and communications have been jammed. Doctor teached us and escaped on the train. Well, that's just rude. He should have stayed to be his guest. Enough. I need to focus. I will contact you as soon as possible. Go get him, Tiger. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>
Okay, Egghead. Now you've gone too far. Damn it. The Doctor is well known for these kinds of tactics, but this time feels hastily planned. He must be desperate. But why? Rouge, the doctor is leaving the station. I need... Shadow. I'm listening. You've done well. Retreat. Go and wipe the situation from here. <laughs> Affirmative. This time it's different. I can't afford to lose. Chance against me this time, Hedgehog! We both know how this will end! Right, Robotnik? of Section 618B of the Mutual Protection Act. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. Huh? Hey! The Emeralds! You can't take them! According to Section 600 of the Mutual Protection Act, you, Sonic, are also in violation. Uh, what? The agreement states that you oversee the protection of the Chaos Emeralds, does it not? Since you have failed to uphold your end of the contract, the Guardian Units of Nations are now responsible for the Chaos Emeralds. If it wasn't for me, Eggman would have escaped with the Emeralds! You're lucky that we don't take you in as well, Hedgehog. Stop, you fools! You can't let the Emeralds fall into the hands of- Who are 
are you? <laughs> you may call me exiled. What an honor to finally meet you. Controller of the light. We're finished here. God has been very useful to me. But everything must come to an end. Wait! Stop! Give them back! made it. The Chaos Emeralds have securely connected our worlds. Once separated, united again. Now, there is no need to fight for the resources of the planets. The energy of Chaos will be enough for everyone. We're ready to strive for a better future. Together. Isn't that true, my friend? Why, Shadow? Why'd you do it? I believe I can answer that. Eggman! Ah. In the flesh! And if it wasn't for my on-the-spot brilliance, you never would have made it out alive. Ahem! <coughs> Your fox boyfriend offered some assistance too, I guess. So... Ugh! I can't believe it! That was... Indeed. A Matarex. You and that boy Thorndike always had a strong sense of justice. But this time, even you can't argue. He screwed up. You mean Chris? What are you saying, Eggman? What does he have to do with what's going on? Hmm. Thorndike was certainly ambitious. As you know, traveling to different dimensions wasn't in perfect science back then. Even for the likes of me, messing with the very fabric of time and space can wreak and toll havoc on a living organism. And unfortunately for your old friend, doing so twice within a short period of time caused his body to age rapidly, giving him roughly 15 years to live. Well, climbing up to the GON's highest position and changing their war-torn ways was no small feat. And during that time of maintaining peace, he had found a new friend. Does that mean... I don't know how or where they met, 
But this Metarex, who calls himself the Exiled, was impressed with Chris's naive ideologies to change the world for the better. So they worked together closely for the time he had left. And once Chris was... gone... The bureaucratic suits, internal politics reverted their interests back to the armored conflict. The exiled saw Thorndike's life work destroyed and wanted nothing to do with Juan any longer. He has recruited Shadow for his own gains, and now he wants to manipulate time itself. It is already possible to manipulate time using Chaos Control with the Chaos Emerald, so why does the exiled need all of them? You should already know the answer for that one. Twin Tails, think! A copious amount of energy is needed to rip open a hole in the fabric of time and space. I had already attempted this once before, but it ended in failure. I may have slightly miscalculated the numbers. <laughs> Forgot to carry the three. But the Exile has found the solution. Although it looks like he didn't divulge the details to Shadow. All right, Egghead. If you know the details, then spill it. What is the solution? Don't get your quills in the knot, Sonic. There's only one method of creating more energy than what the Emeralds can produce on their own. And that is by their destruction. Huh? The burst would be enormous. Enough for the journey to the dawn of time itself. And yet... N no way. I, I don't believe it. That kind of destructive power would destroy life as we know it. Our friends would be gone. You may not believe it, but the Amans surely do. Gnarl, Vortex, Ember, those ancient guardians of chaos are deeply connected to the Emeralds. If the Emeralds themselves are in immediate danger, they are awakened from their slumber in order to protect their master. I have encountered Ember, and that bringer of chaos single-handedly destroyed my entire robot fleet. It took me a whole week to manufacture them. Hmm... What? You yourselves have encountered Gnarl. If they believe in this impending danger, then it would be wise to believe as well. It doesn't matter what they believe, because we're gonna stop this exiled guy! Yeah, only I am allowed to take over this planet, and I'm not going to let some third-rate villain take that away from me! Hey... Is this where I think it is? Oh, yes. The Exiled Citadel. Our destination! Yeah... Reactor's power is at 50%. You might not have enough if you fly too high. Keep that in mind. Eggman, thank you. unite his world with ours, but he never got to before he... Then Eggman took advantage of Chris's dream when the time of awakening happened! Are you talking about the Dark Gaia incident? Yeah. Temples aren't supposed to be in this world, like human cities in our dimension. If the Emeralds disappear, so will her home. We have to find Exile quickly! He must be hiding in one of these rifts! Then let's get looking! You talked about me! 
I suppose it is only natural for friends to talk about each other. We're not friends. I still haven't forgiven you for all the things you've done. Not for Earth, not for Chip, and certainly not for Angel Island. But here we are. It's fun.
Adjust! 